Mama. Jaeger looks like he's about to drop these. Carson. I love you. Carson, you better hide that from Jaeger. Okay. Eat it. Can you close my door, please? Jaeger, what are you going to do when we move out? You're going to be so sad. Hey guys, it's Carson. Welcome back to my channel. And so today, I'm going to be doing my back to school haul. A couple things. So, I have an order from Sheen that's supposed to come in after school starts. So, I'll show you guys that whenever that comes in. But, I went to Target today and I got some stuff. So, I figured I'd show you. Hold on. I figured I'd show you guys. So, there's not a lot of stuff. But, I'm going to show you what I got so far. And then, I'll cut in and tell you guys what I got from Sheen. Because I do not remember. So, first thing is this like locker organizer i guess and i'm going with a theme which is like green earth base let me like open it up and show you oh my god it's going so cute it is so stinking cute and it comes with this little like planty marker and then it comes with this little basket small little basket to put like pencils and whatnot in and then it came with this mirror up oh. Hello. And it's just like a basic mirror that you can get from literally anywhere. But it has a magnet on the back so I can put it in my locker. Then the dry erase board, which I definitely will be using. I got these green post-its to go with my little green thing that I have going on. Yeah, that's green post-its. Okay, and then I got these pencils. These are the same pencils I got last year, but I think they were a little bit different. I also went to Office Depot or Staples to get my school supplies last year. And this year I went to Target. So. And these erasers, you can't find them anywhere. I don't know why you can't find them anywhere. I don't know where to find them. So if you know where these erasers, where I can find them, please comment down below. So then next, I got these uh, Sharpie highlighters. Oh, there's a purple one? Obviously, I have not looked at them. I just kind of glanced over it and I thought that one was a blue one. Next, I got this five star, wait, right? Yeah, five star notebook, the dividers in it. And I normally use this for math. And then I got these jeans. And at my high school, my new, oh, that's so scary, my high school, we can wear holes in our jeans. So guess what you have all got? Holes, because I love holy jeans. They're a little long and I'm not gonna try them on, but it fits, so that's all that matters and I don't really care. The only thing is, ever since I got my surgery, I had this like nasty scar on my knee and it's really gross to me because I have keloids, which is like a, I develop keloids when I scar and um, I don't really know why. I guess it's just my genetics and stuff. And it's only on my, like the front part of my knee that I have a keloid. I'm not gonna show you guys my scar because I'm really insecure about it, which is fine. I don't really care. It's not like this big secret or anything. But I know I need to pack my bag and like open up these bad boys. I've already decided what book bag I'm gonna use. This is the book bag that I am gonna be using for probably three weeks. And currently, this is my gym bag. So I guess I'm gonna show you what's in my gym bag. So like normally I would wear running shoes to the gym because I normally warm up on the treadmill. These are my lifting shoes, which are just regular vans. And then I have my knee brace just in case something happens or I feel like I need a little bit more support on my knee. Then I have my band, which I need to put downstairs because I'm making an at-home gym in my basement. So uh, ignore my pimple patch stuff, whatever. I kind of quit that project because it's literally infested with spiders. And I don't like bugs or anything like that, if you don't know. There was a spider, probably about that big, my head for reference, in there. And I was just like, yeah, no, I'm, I'm done with this. So, yeah, I'm just going to stick with going to, like, an actual gym. I'm going to keep most of the stuff in here, which are, like, tampons, band-aids, a tiny hairbrush. Yeah, that's it. And then a little thing of hand sanitizer, because bye-bye COVID. We don't like you. Yeah, that's what's in there. I'm going to put that in there. I'm gonna put like, I don't know where I'm putting those. Actually, I'm not gonna do the locker stuff right now because I'm gonna, they're probably gonna have us do our lockers later. So I'm not getting a locker because it's literally just a waste of time for like my schedule. Like I start school like in the mornings on one side of the school and then I end my day at the other side of the school. It's just easier if I just have my book bag with me and all my stuff with me, so. And I am still using my locker stuff. The only thing I'm not using is that basket in the mirror. I'm just gonna deal with the locker stuff later. I'm not gonna pack that for now. But look, I get to open up the pencils. That was the most terrible rip I've ever done. That was so ungraceful. I am so sorry for that. But for now, so I don't lose anything, I'm gonna put start putting stuff in here. And then now we get to open up the highlighters. This little hole in the back, I guess you're supposed to help you open it. It doesn't do anything. 
So I'm just gonna take one for now of each color and keep the rest of them as backup. So we got like the whole rainbow going on. We got pink, orange, yellow, green, blue, purple. This is just temporary. Oh, it's raining. Cool. I'm gonna tell you guys when my glasses are. So classes I have. So I have homeroom. And then I have intro into digital technology, the intro to LPSCS. If you don't know what that means, that means law and public safety, criminal, I don't know what else stands for. But it's more like law and public safety. That's what I'm assuming that means. And then I have geometry B slash algebra two, which is actually a 10th grade standard. And I'm gonna be taking that in ninth grade and I'm not excited for that. And then I have history, world, History. Don't know what H world history means, but okay. But every period is now 97 minutes, 96 minutes. I don't know. And now we get out 30 minutes later than last year, and I am very upset about that. Okay, this is gonna be cool. Ready? That is so smart. Yeah, that's all I got for you guys so far. We're putting this. Last year I got white, and this year I'm getting black. Hey guys, today's currently Wednesday the 11th. It's like a week or so later. I don't remember the last time I filmed, but I got all my stuff in here some of it and then the rest is on the floor so i got a bunch of things off the sheen okay so first i got these like elastic bands it's a bunch of little like rubber bands next we have all of these claw clips so this pack came with a pack of five and it came with like a lighter brown this pink black like a sagey green and then a navy blue. And then I got two bigger ones, yellow and brown. I got a bunch of necklaces and this one has a butterfly on it. And then this one says angel on it. And then this one has like a little gold plate. This one has a key on it. This one has a rose. And then this one has a, like a little lock. So yeah, there's all those necklaces. Then I got this big old pack of scrunchy band thingies. And then I got this shirt. It just has like a little wave on it. Very cute, very snazzy. And then next I got this like crew neck. I don't really like the fabric. It kind of freaks me out. But it says New York, USA on it. And then I got I got this shirt that says Angel on it. And my camera battery is dying. So yeah, hold up. Hey guys, so it is a lot longer later. Like I'm already in high school. Today is currently August 18th. So yeah. Oh, I got my hair. <laughs> and also, yes, I saw bangs. They're just they're long enough for me to tuck them back now. So I just got these blonde strips right behind my ear and they're really cute. They're really subtle. I have them like out right now, but like normally you can't really see them. So, oh, and I'm wearing the jeans that I was telling you about. Okay, these are the jeans. They're really snazzy, really cute. Ah, these are what the jeans look like. They're ripped, cool. So I'm gonna show you what clothes I got. They're currently in the closet. Hello, I'm short. Hello, down here. If you don't know, I'm five foot one and a half. I shrunk. You're looking down at me, you're on top of my dress right now. Fresh shirt. I got this shirt, that says if you ate crockin', you ate rockin'. Um, the material, don't recommend. Bought it as a joke, probably should've saved eight bucks. This one, it says women on it. Um, this one's see-through as well, but it's not as see-through as the other one. It's a white shirt, what'd you expect? This shirt right here, that says song name, artist name, and it has the Spotify playing. I thought it was cute. I didn't get any long sleeves, because I have plenty. This is all my short sleeve. The rest there are long sleeve and he keeps going past where you can see. There's a shirt, it's wrinkled. I gotta put this back in the dryer. But this is what it says. Broken. Whoa, you can barely see that. It's so wrinkled, but it is on the floor for two days. But it says Brooklyn on it. Brooklyn, New York. It's really cute, I like it a lot. It's on the floor right in front of me. This shirt that I wore yesterday is so cute. It's one of my favorites. It's really big. And if you get this shirt, size down, for sure. Unless you like stuff super duper for size. Like this right here is a medium. This one says, has flames on it, says angel and it's plain black. Oh, I got a couple of accessories. I don't remember what the last thing I showed you, but I know for a fact I didn't show you this purse. It's about the size of my head. Let me show you what the size of the purse I normally use is. My phone might fit in there, about it. Also, I got my nails done again. So they look like they're lavender with the cow print. I rediscovered something, well, two things really. This from Clean Beauty, really good setting. Or like setting spray, facial spray. I use it like pretty much for everything. I, I use it in my soap for everything. Like, you know how you spray water on there? I use this and it works really good. And it's free as synthetic or 
fragrance. This is rose water and it has aloe vera and hyaluronic acid in it. And it smells really good. I mean, like it doesn't smell really good like perfume. It has like a soft, rosy smell. It smells really good. There's that. And then there's this soft as butter lotion, which I have rediscovered because this was in my drawer that I completely forgot about. This is a coconut and vitamin C body butter. It's from Body Prescriptions. Really good lotion. I love it so much. It's literally my favorite. Like, look how much I've used of it. Like, I'm almost at the halfway point. And I like it because you know how like lotion, it makes my hands slippery and I really don't like that. So, I never used lotion so I would get ashy, you know. But like, I didn't like, like use lotion and then i i got that because i was like oh body butters because it like blew up on tiktok not that specifically um but body butters in general and i was like oh i really want a body butter and i think the one that blew up is the one from truly beauty which i still really want which is i think it was the unicorn body butter and it looks really good now i want to get more truly products i've never gotten them before um because when they're expensive yeah that's all i got for school and thanks for listening to me ramble a little bit i hope you guys like my new hair my new look my new style yeah thank you guys so much for watching if you enjoyed it make sure you thumbs up why not it helps me out make sure you subscribe so that way you, your girl can get to 100 subscribers i would really appreciate it but make sure you follow my other social media as well which will be listed down below i have a bunch of video links listed down below as well so make sure you go watch those and yeah thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you in the next one bye You mean bread and butterflies? Oh yes, of course I- hmm? We've been dancing for so long under the stars